Yo, you guys, welcome back to another video. This is Michigan Sports Talk here. And now, uh, before we get into this one, I'm sorry, guys, I did not post a video Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, have been having some, um, you know, things going on and um, some bad news, but, um, but yeah, I'm pretty much back. Um, probably, I don't know if I'll be able to post a video at all this weekend. Um, but, uh, but yeah, guys, so sorry again. I uh, just had some bad news here throughout these last two days. Um, but I will be back after Monday at least. Um, but hopefully I can post a video during the weekend, but let's get right into today's video. We're going to be previewing Michigan's first game in the Big Ten tournament, which will either be against Michigan State or Maryland. They're playing right now currently as I'm recording this video, and uh, Maryland is looking pretty good right now as they're leading Michigan State by 10. But let's get right into today's video, guys, and check out on what Michigan needs to do when they play um, one of these two teams. Alright, so we're going to start with Maryland first. Um, I would wait until after the game, but... Um, I, you know, have everything going on, so we're going to record this video right now, and right now Maryland's winning, so we're going to start with Maryland first. Um, in our first game, we beat them 84-73, and um, as you can see here, Michigan's box score here, Livers had 7 points, Hunter Dickinson went off, had 26 points, 11 rebounds, uh, Mike Smith had 16 points, Franz Wagner had 19 points, Eli Brooks had 10 points. I mean, just a, a outstanding game here. Um, but our defense really wasn't that great. As you can see, um, Scott had 19 points, and um, Ayla a uh, had 16 points, Hamilton had 15 points. Those are the three guys that you gotta um, obviously watch um, against us here. And, um, and now let's go ahead and look at the stats here. Field goal wise, percentage Michigan shot 58.8%, Maryland shot 48.3%. Three pointers, 31.6%. Maryland, 59.1%. So right, that right there need to needs to uh, go up a little bit. Free throws, 90%, really good. And Maryland was 66.7%. Now total rebounds, we out we out rebounded them 29 to 23. Um, they had one more offensive rebound, and um, we each had 12 turnovers, so that wasn't that great. Um, now let's go ahead and look at the second game that we played against Maryland now. We beat Maryland again, 87 to 63. That's a much better score here. Um, now Michigan stats here: Livers had 20 points, Mike Smith had 11 points, Hunter Dickinson only had three points, uh, Franz Wagner had 15 points, Tony Brown six, Eli Brooks seven, Brandon Johns Jr. 11 points, Austin Davis nine points. Uh, Maryland here. Uh, Scott had 13 points. Wiggins had 11 points. He is doing really good right now against Michigan State, so uh, watch out for him as well. Um, a don't know how to pronounce his name. Ayla. Uh, I don't know if I got that right, but he had 12 points. Uh, Hamilton had 10 points. Um, and yeah. So now let's go ahead and look at the stats for that game. Field goals, Michigan shot 51.8%, 41.2%. And all I'm going to say right now is we need to shoot better. Um, against Michigan State, we did terrible. Uh, we'll get into that game later. Uh, Three-pointers, they shot 21.1%, and we shot 50%. So if we can get over 50% on field goals and three-pointers, I mean, it's almost guaranteed a win um, if we just start, you know, shooting well. And again, the total rebounds, we out-rebounded them by 10, 36-26. Uh, and that's really going to be um, very key here in the Big Ten tournament, out-rebounding teams. If you don't out-rebound a team, you're more than likely going to lose um, because, you know, just had some bad games. But now let's go ahead and look at Michigan State. Um, let me pull up the game here. Um, all right, so here's the first game. We beat them 69-50, obviously won the Big Ten with that win. Um, Henry had 14 points, and that was really the only guy that contributed that much. Um, Sissoko had eight points. Rocket Watts only had six. Lanford had six. Marble had four. Um, Michigan now. Livers, nine points. Dickinson, 14 points. Fredens Wagner, 19 points. Mike Smith, nine. Eli Brooks, nine. Uh, Brandon Johns Jr., six. And that is really it. So obviously, we played a great game there. Um, after a, a really bad loss to Illinois, came back, bounced back, beat our rival. Now, field goal percentage, again, it's it's 50%. Um, they only shot 36.4%. They made no three-pointers. We, we uh, shot 43.8%. And um, free throws don't really matter. Total rebounds, 
Um, now let's go ahead and look at the second game against Michigan State, which really was not great. So here we go. Michigan uh, Livers, or yeah, we'll start with Michigan Livers had 9 points. Dickinson had 12 points. Mike Smith had 11 points. Fred Wagner had 10 points. Uh, Tony Brown had 13 points. Eli Brooks had 5 points and got hurt. Austin Davis had 4 points. So we have a couple guys over double digits. Um, there's only four though, and it really isn't high, you know, scoring double digits. Now we look at Michigan State side. Rocket Watts had 21 points. Langford had seven. Henry had 18 points. Hall had three points. Hauser had 11 points. Um, Bingham Jr. had five points. And uh, really, all you gotta do if Michigan State wins, you gotta you gotta be able to control the inside. You gotta be able to out rebound them. Um, you gotta control Rocket Watts. Uh, he had 21 points. He should not be scoring that many points. He has struggled recently, so you gotta make him struggle against your defense as well. Henry, you gotta contain him as well. Um, now we look at field goal percentage. 41.67 uh, from field goal percentage. Again, it's not over 50. You don't win. Um, but you know, you still can win if you get over like probably the 45% mark here against. Maryland or Michigan State, but once you play against like you know Illinois, you gotta shoot close to 50% at least um, in order to win the game. I feel like Michigan State you, they shot better than you, 44.4%. Three pointers we really struggled, 31.8%, and they are 36.4%. Now the total rebounds they out rebounded you, 38-32, only by six. But you know when you have you know big guys like we do, you gotta out rebound them, and it, the offensive rebounds. You just you can't allow that. Um, we also had eight turnovers. They did as well. But so that's really all the stats I have, you guys. Um, and now yeah, we play tomorrow at 11:30 a.m. Um, probably gonna have to miss the game, um, but I may be able to watch it here and there. Um, but yeah, like I said, I just got things going on. Some bad news here. Um, but you know, not really gonna get into my you know uh, family life or personal life, but. Just, uh, you know, thank you guys for your patience and everything, and, um, and like I said, I should be back, uh, uh, you know, after Monday, or I might make a video throughout the weekend here, uh, we'll see, maybe Saturday or Sunday, um, but yeah, guys, um, and let's just go ahead and talk here, I mean, I got all the stats out every and everything, and really the th major thing here is Michigan has to be able to shoot well, if they do not shoot well, um, we're, we're gonna lose, you know, so when you play, uh, Maryland, Michigan State, um, I'm pretty sure you're probably gonna be playing Maryland, so I think you should be able to beat Maryland, uh, you should be able to beat both these teams, you know, you should be able to go in there and win this Big Ten tournament, um, but, you know, you might have to play Ohio State and Illinois back-to-back, -back, so we'll see our mental toughness there. But, um, you know, you, you got to out-rebound them, you got to shoot good, and you got to hit your three-pointers. You know, people just got to step up. You know, Franz Wagner, he's, he has to do good. Isaiah Livers, you have to do good. You can't take stupid shots um, at the point where you can get into the game. I know against Michigan State, we were down by, like, three. Took a three, tried to tie it. He took a three, like, twice from really deep out, you know, and missed them both. You know, at that point you just gotta drive in and you know keep driving in you know you know you can't shoot that well so you gotta keep driving in and I just think you know he got caught up in the moment and he just gotta do a better job of you know being a leader and realizing no maybe I shouldn't take this long jump shot here um you know and he missed them both so um but yeah you gotta shoot well you gotta out rebound them and you gotta play good defense as well our defense got lazy um and you got to be tougher than the team you got to be a, the aggressor and other than that i think we should be fine um but yeah guys i'm glad i get to make this video for you guys i said i would make it tuesday but you know i just had things happen um you know just some bad news and um but everything's gonna be okay and uh should make a video um probably honestly on sunday um I'm not really sure. Probably on Sunday we'll make a Big Ten, uh, you know, tournament recap video. If Michigan wins it or Illinois or you know whoever wins it, go after, go uh, look at that. And then um, Monday, I don't know if I'll be able to make a video. I probably won't be able to 
Tuesday I should be able to make a video though and you know give my bracket to you guys so you guys can see what I what I'm doing for the NCAA tournament because NCAA tournament bracket will be out by then and I will make one and I'll be going over it it's great time guys March Madness can't wait and um yeah other than that guys hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did I greatly appreciate it if you guys could hit that subscribe button um it really you know motivates me and really makes me happy um we're at 60 subs so if you guys could hit that i greatly appreciate it other than that um you know like i said just gotta out rebound them shoot good um be the aggressor be tough and um hopefully we win uh hope hope you guys have a great rest of your day we'll see you guys